The Journey of Abraham Before the Labels. A Desert Landscape. Abraham, a thoughtful man, stands beneath the vast sky. The Calling of Abraham. Abraham, in his tent, gazes at the stars. In the ancient land of Mesopotamia, a man named Abraham pondered the mysteries of existence. Born during the reign of Nimrod, he grew up in a society steeped in idolatry. But within him burned a desire for truth, a quest that would shape history. Why do we worship these lifeless idols? Is there not a single force behind creation? The Tower of Babel Abraham joins the construction of the towering edifice. The Tower of Babel reached toward the heavens a testament to human ambition. Yet Abraham sensed its folly. He rebuked the builders, urging them to seek unity not through bricks, but through understanding. We are one people speaking one language, but true unity lies in recognizing the divine within us. The divine decree, God's voice echoes. Let us confound their language. Seventy angels descend, each assigned a nation and a tongue. Abraham's lot, the Hebrews. Abraham's path diverged. He became the patriarch of a people destined for greatness, but was he a Jew? The covenant Abraham circumcises himself. Some say Abraham initially held the status of a non-Jewish Noahide. But when God commanded circumcision, he embraced the covenant. Was he then a full-fledged Jew? No, since the kingdom of Judah hasn't come into existence yet. And the only reason why the Hebrews call themselves Jews is because of the loss of the ten tribes in the kingdom of Israel. They labeled themselves Jews only as a reminder of not losing themselves and so that they can find each other. The lot pleases me, for portions have fallen to me in pleasant places. The legacy unfolds. A desert oasis. Moses, a shepherd, stands near a burning bush. The burning bush Moses approaches the bush. I am that I am. Moses, liberate my people from Egypt. Moses led the Hebrews, a diverse group, out of bondage. Were they Jews? The revelation at Sinai Moses receives the Torah. At Sinai, the Israelites' nation was born. But Moses, like Abraham, existed before the labels. His mission transcended religious boundaries. We are bound by covenant, not by ethnicity. Our faith unites us. The Tapestry of Faith A bustling marketplace, a wise scholar addresses a crowd. The Scholar's Discourse Friends, labels matter less than our shared quest for truth. Abraham, Moses, they were seekers. Their legacy extends beyond any religion. But what about Islam? Islam emerged later with Muhammad. Yet the essence, submission to God, existed since Abraham's time. And the Hebrews? They too submitted to God, the first to do so. But let us not quarrel over names. Our faiths weave a rich tapestry. Beyond labels. Abraham, Moses, and the scholars stand together. So was Abraham Jewish? Was Moses Muslim? Labels fade against the vastness of eternity. Seek truth, embrace unity, and remember, faith transcends time. The desert landscape remains a canvas for countless stories. This story was written by me, Gino DiCaprio.